a lot less movement underneath now that the uh, thing has been uh, put back. Now that the floor has been uh, put back on properly, the net floor. Good, good. That's a nice. Although there's still some, some underneath. But they're it it well. felt glued down today, that did. Yeah. I think it's dried soap that's spilt, isn't it? It is indeed. They would have followed the rules. Yes, they're brilliant. Look at that. Show it to the camera. That's cool. A textbook, it. isn't it? Built that themselves. Wow, it's getting full in there. Textbook. No, the thing is, the Queen should have emerged by now. And she's been open for a couple of days. There's plenty of drain drain here. Hmm, not as much comb as I thought there might be. I think they've started on one. Well, I think she'd have been able to get out of that by now. That's the queen cage. Yeah. And that is did have a block of sugar on the end keeping the queen in place. Is it worthwhile putting some starter comb in there for them? Yeah, you a could strip. Do it. It's just a pain in the ass to make it stick. Yeah. And it's just yeah. I mean they've got food here. I might could do probably do a change in that, it's just got a bit of few bodies on it. Yeah. May have to close it off so we can pour it out. I put a couple of sticks in so they wouldn't all drown. Mm. Yeah, it looks as good, it's just now just fermenting the bodies in it, isn't it? So mm. it's a case of mm. that slot's open enough at the front, isn't it, for them to come and go. Yeah, it's have enough so the queen can come in and out, yeah. She's mm. already out. She's in. Just gone under that thing there, sure. She's hiding. Yeah, I don't blame her. She doesn't want to come out this time of night, does she? Think there'll be no drones around? Well, there was one just now. <laughs> just so. so, if we could make up a tiny bit of sugar syrup at some point tomorrow, yeah. then we'll do the How do we get the sugar syrup out of there now? I will show you. Okay. Um, Those pieces come from mine or from yours? They came from, from Athena. The they? Came from what? Athena. At the yeah, because they were up at the apron, weren't they? Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. And so, because they're very quiet, you know, you can tell why it's not quite nice. Athena, Athena was quite nice. Then we have to tap those off the lid as well. Oh, go away. Now the screen goes on, and that keeps them all in place. Go away, lady, come on. How are you going to get that sugar in? Ah, that will be your sis. If we slide the lid back just so. Keep an eye on the bees. Yeah. Like that much. Yep. Mm -hmm. And you smoke them out of it first. Then tip it, you can tip it out. Should I do that now? Tip it yeah, out? why not? Then it's done, isn't it? 
So pretty we can't remove the whole thing and leave a, a safe wall in there, isn't it? No, no. I'm just going to pour it onto the floor. Mm -hmm. Gotta keep the queen intact. So we'll make up some fresh sugar juice tomorrow. A few bits of wood go back in. The floaters. So the bees have got something to sit on so they don't drown. And if you've never seen bearding before. Classic bearding for you. They'll all go back in the hive because it's starting to get cold now. Hmm. Maybe the odd one or two stays outside because they don't know any better, but we should be fairly safe, I think. And then we put a brick on top, and tomorrow I'll we'll put some more sugar juice in there. The lid in front of you had water in it today, so they had the uh, a local water source. You wait for a delivery? No, we were earlier on, so we bought, I brought it into the shovel.